Hello from the American Muscle Car Museum here in Melbourne, Florida. Today what we did is we decided to pull out a beautiful 1978 Mustang II King Cobra. Mustang II as a concept actually started way back in 1970. Lee Iacocca had kind of seen that the original concept of the Mustang being a budget-minded young car was moving away from his original target audience and was getting into more of the quote performance mid-size automobile sports car market. So when they launched the Mustang II in 1974, it was literally perfect timing because the oil embargo with the Arabs had just begun and Americans were looking for more fuel efficient vehicles. With the five liter V8, 139 horsepower at 3,600 RPMs, 250 foot pounds of torque at 1,600 RPMs, was actually a fuel efficient vehicle. Average EPA rating was 17 miles per gallon, 15 in the city, 19 on the highway. This vehicle, of course, is fully loaded, even comes with the optional factory T-tops. T-tops were the in thing starting in the late 1970s in America, and that was a $546 option if you wanted to, quote, check off the T-top box. Beautiful color, tangerine is the official color code. And if you look at the interior, you have a beautiful tangerine black plaid interior. In 1974, when they came out with the new Mustang II, they sold 385,000 units in the United States. By 1978, sales had fallen to only 185,000 units. This was the first Mustang that weighed less than 3,000 pounds. But one of the most important features that this car had it now had rack and pinion steering. And so from a handling point of view, the 78 Mustang King Cobra drove so much better and handled so much better than let's say the previous generation Mustangs that Ford was producing. That being said, with the anemic five liter engine, let's face it, performance was not there. You know, the four speed, they averaged typically in the high nines for zero to 60 times, which you're kind of amazed, at high nines for zero to 60. And in the low 11s, zero to 60, if you had the automatic. The vehicle we have here at the American Muscle Car Museum, we have the original factory paperwork, the original window sticker, all the original bill of sale documents, as well as the deluxe Marty report. Today, this vehicle has 5,416 original miles. Go ahead, check us out a little bit more at the AmericanMuscleCarMuseum.com where we have over 50 Mustangs and Shelbys represented at the American Muscle Car Museum. You're also welcome to follow us on Facebook or Instagram. Thank you.